Hey guys, welcome back to another Aotearoa review with yours truly, Lexa Dixon. It's good to see you motherfuckers all again. So last night I had the absolute wonderful opportunity to go and see a band called Curly's Jewels live at Valhalla. Now if you don't know anything about Curly's Jewels, they are a four piece band from Wellington. So their band evolved in 2011, so I have no idea why it's taken me so long to hear of this extraordinary band. And they've just released their latest single, Absentee. And here's a little sneak peek for you. To keep my mind together. Give me some answers to these questions that are plaguing me. These are the questions with no answers, so you blame in me. Too blind to see. Mr. Absentee, you're breaking me. So this track was recorded at Roundhead Studios in Auckland with the legendary producer Greg Haver. He's done works with the likes of Manic Street Preachers, Bullet For My Valentine and so on. And it was mixed by the 2017 New Zealand Music Awards winning producer Clint Murphy. Now, you should probably know Clint from Devilskin. They've played supports to Head Like A Hole, Devilskin, Sumo Psycho, Skinny Hobos, four sold out shows with The Feelers, on the 25th anniversary tour and the end of the year highlights supporting international rock giants Living Colour as part of their vivid anniversary tour. Their EP The Skin We Shed which peaked at number 11 on the official New Zealand Top 40 New Zealand album chart with the two singles Terror in Disguise and Bastard Fate both receiving radio play on various stations across New Zealand. The band successfully completed a North Island headline tour and performance at the New Zealand Tattoo and Art Festival in 2017, on the bill with amazing acts including Alien Weaponry, Tikitane and Head Like a Hole. So this was my first time seeing Curly's Jewels and they did not disappoint. I first heard of them just recently because they're playing at a fundraising event that I'm organising for Christchurch more information at the end of this video and yeah I've been wanting to see them live ever since just to kind of get a feel for them and whatnot and wow uh, Jail's got a powerful voice she's got her own style it's rock music of course but it's in like a different kind of way it's delivered differently uh, you got Aaron on the guitar and oh man he's a phenomenal guitarist you got Andy on the bass and he just makes that bass work and then there's Corey on the drums. So yeah, the the receivership from the audience last night was, you know, also something to go on and they were not let down. They were jamming, they were jumping, they were moshing, they were having a bloody good time. So if you're keen to see a New Zealand rock band that's gonna blow your socks off, then Curly's Jewels is definitely the guys for you. And you can see them, if you're in Wellington, coming up on the 19th of July at Banting Together, Rock and Metal for Christchurch, where we will be having the likes of Kyrelian Theory, The Heathen Collective, Lucifer Gun, Hades Drudge, and of course, Curly's Jewels. So information and ticketing for that can be found on Cosmic Ticketing. And like I said, if you're in Wellington, you don't want to miss Curly's Jewels, and you don't want to miss the other four acts, because it's going to be an awesome night. But anyways, that's enough from me. Uh, like I said, definitely go check out Curly's Jewels on Spotify and YouTube. Check out their Facebook page, their website. Definitely, definitely, definitely go and give them a watch. They are definitely worth it. And um, yeah, big shout out to you guys, Curly's, for having me. So until our next review, remember to continue rocking out and check out some local acts. 
And why don't you tell us a band that you'd like us to see and go and review and we'll see what we can do. Alright, that's it from me. Hi,